Hello everyone, welcome to another Thailand travel video. Today I'm taking you to the world famous Similan Island tour. In this trip, we are going to be visiting some of the 11 Similan Islands including Koh Similan which has the famous rock formation called Sailing Rock. It's going to be a lot of boat rides between the islands, beautiful snorkeling sites and hiking in the jungle. So I will be giving you all of the details about this 8 hour excursion. Let's start with how we got here. We drove to the meeting point from the Haven Resort and it took us about half an hour to get here. I highly recommend the Haven Resort if you're traveling in the area or planning to visit Similan Islands just like us. After a short briefing about the tour and a light breakfast, we hop on a speedboat around 9 o'clock. By the way, they don't let you take your sandals or flip-flops on the boat. So you should definitely bring a pair of water shoes. Even I consider the boat ride was pretty smooth, I highly recommend bringing some seasickness pills if you're sensitive to boat rides. After about an hour boat ride, we finally reach our first stop, island number 4 and 5. We are gonna stay here about an hour for snorkeling only, so let's jump in the water before we run out of time. After an incredible snorkeling adventure, now we are getting ready for our second stop, island number 4, Koh Miang. On this stop, we are gonna go on the island, have a lunch and enjoy the beautiful beach. <laughs> Look at this beauty guys, the sand, the water and the trees, so beautiful. We arrive in paradise. So this is fairly a bigger island and it's in the middle of the other islands. I think because of the location, the Similan Islands National Park headquarters in this island. While we are on our way to lunch, let me give you some information about the islands. There are a total of 11 islands and they all lie 70 kilometers off the coast of Pangna province of Thailand. Island number 1, 2 and 3 close to the public due to turtle hatching protection. I will give you more information on the next island so let's check out the lunch now. Finally made it to the lunch place after a short but hot walk. I had seafood soup with veggies, rice and fruit. Nothing fancy but it was delicious. Ok let's go check out the beach now. I don't know if you can see it but there are a lot of bats on these trees. Besides the national park headquarters, there are some cabins with restrooms, showers and also a first aid station. If you're planning on coming here in April, be ready for the heat, because it's the hottest month in Thailand. Look at this beautiful view guys, even though we're having a really hot day, it feels great out here. Let's go walk on the beach and I'm gonna show you guys around. By the way, this is part of our 18 days Thailand trip. In this trip, we are visiting Bangkok, Phuket, Krabi, Similan Islands, PP Island and Riley Beach. So if you're planning on visiting any of these places or just curious about them, 
make sure to check out the Thailand playlist on my channel and don't forget to subscribe. Seems like we just find the perfect photoshoot spot. Even though we are so far away, these rock formations reminds me of Seychelles. I haven't been there but I heard it's very expensive to visit, so you can have very similar experiences here in similar islands of Thailand. Oops, that later almost fall into the water. So again, my biggest recommendation to you is bring water shoes. By the way, similar islands were formed 65 million years ago. Yes, 65 million. So I'm walking on 65 million years old rocks and I don't think they've been moved or modified by humans. So it's crazy when you think about it. I think our time is over in this island, so let's go back to the boat. That was a great stop. Now we're on our way to island number 9, Koh Bangnu. This is gonna be another snorkeling spot, so we're not allowed to go to the beach. But look at this formation guys, and the water is so beautiful, turquoise color. Even though sky is very hazy today, the water is so clear you can see all the way to the bottom. Okay, let's jump in the water and see if we can find any exotic fishes. What a beautiful experience, I feel like I just visited another planet. So now we're going to the final and the most famous island of the Similan Islands group. This one is island number 8, also called the Similan Island. Here it is, the world famous sailing rock on top of the hills and I'm definitely going to climb there. Let me give you some information while we are approaching to the beach. Due to the conservation of the marine life, Similan Islands will be closed during the rainy season, which is starting on mid-May to the all the way to the mid-October. 
So if you're planning on visiting Simulon Islands, make sure to book your trip between October through May. Okay, let's go check out the sailing rock on top of the hill. By the way, this is the biggest of the 11 islands. There are restrooms, showers, a small market and a first aid station available on this island. Alright, let's go follow the path and see how long it's gonna take us to get to the top. It is a 150 meters long hike, so it shouldn't take very long. Oh, a little bit of a climb over here. It's gonna be a challenge, bare feet. Oh god. Let me tell you something guys, this is not an easy hike especially barefoot, so once again, please bring your water shoes if you're planning to climb here. Ouchie, ouchie. Oh my god. Look at this. Oh god. Uh. Oh. Oy. Pretty, but wish I had his shoes on. Oh, yeah. Ooh. So I guess I don't need to tell you guys. Make sure bring your water shoes. Oh yeah. Rock right here. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Look at this path, dude. Can you imagine if it's raining? Like you straight go down. That's crazy. You know what? Wow. Yeah, exactly, but the bare feet. Oh my god. Look at this rocks. They look like a bus to fall off. So we gotta go over that little thing? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Oh, they don't fit in here. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at this. Oh my god. I think this is it. Please. Oh, it's hot. It's hot. I think that's it. Wow. Made it. Look at this view guys, it's totally worth a barefoot hike, it's just beautiful. Okay, so it's not over, we gotta climb more to get to the top. Oh my god, look at these rocks guys, they, they look like they're about to fall off. How they even stand like that? To be honest, it's a little scary over here. Wow, look at this, all the colors. This is crazy, like we're on a giant rock on top of the hill in the middle of the ocean. Yeah. 
So this is the famous sailing rock right next to us. Oh, the low tide is happening right now. Water. Yeah, that's why the boat got Yeah. Okay, let's go. Flying, flying. This is the probably second most dangerous thing I ever done after the, uh, swimming with the stingrays. The stingray was a. Uh... It was, no, it was more walk. scary. <laughs> I don't know, but this one bro. This is hurts. We found another viewpoint facing to the other side of the island. So let's check out that and then we go back there. Here we go, back to torture walk. Oh my god. Walking barefoot on these rocks is just like torture. Uh -huh. It hurts so bad. So once again, please bring your water shoes if you're planning to climb here. Oh, still hot. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Why can't they just build? You know how they build all these woods? <laughs> these build See the water. Tight squeeze. Yo, don't look down. <laughs> it's a tight squeeze, dude. Yo, look at the stairs. It's a tight squeeze. Yo, look at the stairs. Oh yo yo It's like one after another, bro. Oh look at this. Thing we're doing today because I got no energy left. Oh, something move over there. Oh, there's stairs. You made it. I'm done. No more beach. You made it. After we get some rest on the island, we took off to go back where we started. It was a long day, but hey, it's totally worth it. So overall, it was a great experience. It is tiring because of a lot of boat rides and island hopping, but it's totally worth the time and effort, so I highly recommend doing it. If you have any questions, you can add it in the comments. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.